Uh, what do I ban? Just ban EGC. Tremble before me. Vilnius will rise again. Can you solo boss with monstrosity? Well, you should not want to because monstrosity cannot pick up the beacon point. So you'll solo it and then someone will come I in and serve. steal it. But the answer is no, it cannot. I think you I was wondering if you could provide some tips on baiting. <laughs> I saw a Reddit post that suggested you were a master in baiting. I must say I'm quite a rookie at baiting, so you've heard wrong. I rarely if ever bait. I bring pandemonium. Greetings. Chen, friend. huh? So, how's the new laning? So, how's the new laning? Uh, turns out it's pretty good. New laning is pretty good. <laughs> Dr. K. Beth. Uh, okay, question from Nimich says, is Hammer viable now? No, she's worse. Uh, how, you, need, you would need an entire Hammer comp around her in order to make it viable. Uh, how's the new laning? It is more snowbally from what I can tell so far, but it might still change. It might still change. Right now it seems that all winning lanes you pick up bonus globes and especially on two lane maps you either win the lane or you lose it, right? And that's half the game or more. So if you're winning, you're snowballing. That seems to be the situation right now, but who knows, it may still change. Try Elemental Bear, okay. Ellie. Ready for Bear, action. Bear. Oh, I don't have it. What? Earth sign. Where is this beast? Locked and loaded. Yeah, I don't have it. For sure. Nova Lily Chen Troll Diablo is pretty good. Someone asked me, can you tell me how Thrall works? I know next to nothing about him. It would be my pleasure. It would be my absolute pleasure, honor and privilege. Thrall is the melee assassin with pretty good poke. Pretty good man mode moment where he has a root and bonus attack speed that allows him to do a lot of damage. 
He has a high auto attack damage, but cannot do auto attacks as safely as a ranged character or a warrior. So he needs to play with life and death, always. Thrall's trait is healing. He heals when he uses enough abilities that connect with enemies. Chain Lightning, which is a bouncing damage poke spell. Feral Spirit, which is a pass through everything, damage it and root all enemy heroes. And Wind Fury, which is your bonus attack speed. I hope you're Use ready. all these to get bonus mm. healing with Frostwolf right. Resilience. Every five abilities that connect give you one stack of healing, which right now is 232, but later it'll be more. How that actually plays out with your bonus movement speed from your auto attack talent, by the way, your auto attack ability, how that the works out is, is as follows. Seconds. You dart in and out of combat, playing with life and death, Five, healing at four, critical moments. Three, and additional two, talents give you additional one. healing. So your point Let is to be a master begin. at baiting the opponent <laughs> and making them think that they can kill you, but then healing up and killing them back. This is generally how he plays. Thrall is a pretty good solo laner. He is a pretty average team fighter, but with his heroic, he can make a massive impact. And this makes him a good laner. This makes him a good team fighter, I mean. The fact that his heroic is so impactful. Lily? Lily! Pressure Q. I will return as soon as I can. I think he was lagging probably. See if we can help uh, Chen. Amazing. Hero slain. That was nice. It's exciting to play with the Chen that pretty much knows uh, Time to choose a what it's doing. Um, do they have powerful auto attacks? The answer is yes. I'll get Feral Resilience. This is a Feral Spirit talent that when you hit your wolf on people, you get auto attack block charges. Up to uh, two stacks of Feral. Uh, sorry, up to two stacks of Feral Resilience, yeah, which is block. 50% block. It also gives you uh oh, hold up. The block charges didn't help. Which is ironic because my distraction at explaining the talent made me die. Using the stacks, though not enough. It was not enough. Uh, yeah, and it also gives you three stacks of Frostwolf Resilience, so it's three-fifths of the way to a full next heal. It is done. The I say we can give up the first uh, objective, as their wave clear is uh, better, and so I would rather prefer to uh, do some laning and some pushing, maybe some marks. And we don't contest too heavily, that'll be nice. Uh, can you see block charges, yes or no? Um, I think you can. Can you? I don't have any right now, so that might make a difference. Oh, you've unlocked a talent. Get 
gonna get Ancestral Wrath. When you stay in minion waves, Zeratul cannot use Singularity Spike on you, and that makes you a lot safer. Greetings, friend. Good to see you back, Grubster. And when you walk away out of range. It's so good to be back, Ransom. Thank you very much for the sub. <laughs> I now have Ancestral Wrath. You get this when you get 8 times uh, your Frostwolf Resilience. So it takes a while to charge it up. It's kind of like an early Blood for Blood. Good work, team. It's kind of like an early Blood for Blood that uh, heals you for more than Blood for Blood would do. Oops. So you see now I have three three charges. I went for three full heals. Mana Titan Ultimate 4 is pretty nice as well. It gives you mana and CDR. By the way, at level 1, you have three types of uh, Chain Lightning talents. One that gives two charges of Chain Lightning. That's the one I have. That's also the uh, easier quest to complete. You get two charges basically and we that's it. It's, it is what it is. Right, whereas you can in Oh yeah, you need to kill 20 lane minions like last hit or, or recent last hit. Oops, I was a bit too hasty. Well, no one saw that. Again, I think if I'm not trying to explain the character as much as I am I will probably be a little bit more focused but there you go at least chat will have a good time from that so yeah 20 lane minions you either last hit or you recently hit them with chain lightning and uh, then they die Uh, the other quest is uh, Crash Lightning, which gives you bonus damage on your secondary and tertiary bounce. If you can multi-hit enemy heroes with Chain Lightning, that's the quest. You do that 40 times and then you get a lot of bonus damage on your secondary bounce. But it is very difficult to complete. And also it means that you are not in the solo lane. So it's very restrictive in terms of where you can lane. An alternative, which is actually underrated because it doesn't have quest dings, which is oh so fun. Wow. It doesn't have... Wow, nice. Hey, he has flying kick damage. Deadly strike. Otherwise, he wouldn't have killed Brightwing. Mm. Yeah, I got out in time. I'm happy about that. Yeah, Rolling Thunder gives you mana return. It gives you even more mana than you initially lose, so long as you auto attack chain lightning time targets. It also gives you bonus range and an extra bounce. It doesn't seem as glorious as two chain lightnings to have 30% range, one extra bounce, and the mana return, but it's actually really good. Should not be underestimated. And I think oftentimes that may just be the right choice as well. It's just that when you go Maelstrom Weapon at level 7, sorry, not Maelstrom Weapon, when you go Ancestral Wrath, you want as many Frostwolf Resilience stacks as possible. As orcishly possible. <laughs> um, and uh, the second Chain Lightning helps much more with that. If you don't get Ancestral Wrath, but you go Follow Through, which is also very good, then I would say get Rolling Thunder. Uh, 
At level 13, I got Frostwolf's Grace, which is a point and heal, I mean a click and heal ability that procs your uh, passive for a greater than usual amount. They are not 13 yet, so we can be aggressive. We can and should Another be aggressive. Will be active soon. Do not let our enemy claim it. They are not 13 yet. That was my passive, 580, I clicked it. Greetings, friend. Playing floor. Locate her OGAR. Doctor Ogar. If I stay out of VP, I can uh Oh <laughs> Locator Ogar. Oh, you actually spelled it Locator. <laughs> Yo, thanks, man. So nice that he got the. Uh, I, I did uh, Ancestral Wrath on Brightwing to finish her. I'm dead. Oh, I was pretty close. I, I should have walked into Precision Strike too. That was uh, that was bad. Wow! <laughs> I was pretty close to um, having more heals and roots and so on. I could have played that better, but it was very exciting. So whatever. Oh, you've unlocked a talent. Yeah, I'll go there when I'm back, but it's 15 seconds out. Can you post this guy to YouTube, please? Yeah, sure. No problem. A frozen Punisher moves against us. Um, at level... By the way, this one is the best. It's better than the other two. Just get it. The only reason not to get Frostal's Grace is if you uh, are afraid that you don't have the mental acuity to use it. At... Uh, Final level, I go Alpha oh, Wolf. It four. makes the root last longer. And. It also gives you Giant Killer on rooted people. I go out of the heal so I don't take heals from people that uh, need it more than me. Oh, that gill name cocktail was huge. We have cleansed these heavens of the demon's punisher. <laughs> get them back today. I know. <laughs> GG Amazing Nice Oh Get him Nova Take down that hero now Okay not GG I think he used Oh no, he didn't. Oh, oh! Kill him! Kill them all! Yay! Nova, heal him! <laughs> Would you say they overstayed a little or a lot? And did we overchase a little or a lot before? Okay, that got a is staying as well. Our 
That's why I make the big bucks. Nah, fella. <laughs> Nobody overstay. This game is hilarious. <laughs> hilarious. Frostal's Grace. Wow. This is just like Warcraft 3. Non stop fight all over the map. Attack, disengage, attack, and disengage. Is this greedy and risky? Yeah. We should enlist the aid of these mercenaries. Actually, I'm gonna get mana. I know that if my wife was watching right now, she would tell me, go get mana. She always thinks I overstay and overextend. I don't know how you can be married to someone and they still don't know you all that well. She thinks I overextend or stay with low mana. For the rest, she's perfect, but in this... We're not 20 yet. Select a talent. Now we are. I get bolt. I should have slow played. We killed all five, so it's okay. Um, we can end with Punisher mid. If Chen, if Chen drinks and they open up the wall, I could have blinked away and and just wait a little bit more. I don't know why I was so e you know we were five versus two. The fact that I died is a uh, I would say a damn shame and a mistake. I thought we need to go, we need to kill them now, but it's really not true because all we gotta do is go back, let Lily heal you up and re-engage. So learning moment for me. Basically every game you play is filled with either Wonderful. happiness or learning moments or allies griefing. But for the most part, if you internalize everything then learning moment it's a good thing you didn't overstay like your wife says you do <laughs> i guess i hope somehow and it's selfish that they get it to one percent die fail and then i come in to finish it it's a bit selfish but not today We won! Outstanding! That was cool. That was good. Uh, very interesting to win with a Chen and a Thrall. Both heroes that are never seen at pro play right now. Or Chen, all that matter, for all that matter, not much in general. So I'm, my vote goes to Chen. Super awesome. Double Panda action. Nice.
wouldn't you want follow through to synergize with two Q charges? So the interesting thing is two Q charges synergizes with both follow through and Radiant ancestral spread. wrath because you get more stacks. My wife says I watch too many grubby streams. PFFFFT, what does she know? <sighs> what does she know? What do they know anyway? What do they know anyway? Nice to see you again, man. Thanks for the 70 years sub. Old man. So what build did Lily go? CDR mana reduction if they heal low ones. Mm -hmm. Cleanse. Jokes. Mass Vortex. Yulon. Wow, this build is all over the place. <laughs> ah, nice. We win. Greetings, friend. Yo, Addison, thanks for the sub, man. Why is Thrall Cursed more popular? Follow. I think because the new laning changes makes people think that, you know, maybe this Thrall, who used to be known as a really good solo laner, maybe he's better. Got Diablo, that's crazy. I'm on the attack. Massive value, then. I'm just gonna kill Fort for free. Wow. Amazing. 